Okay, we have some breaking news related to Grand Theft Auto 6 and some new gameplay you won't want to miss. Alongside the trailer 2's release date, we have all the information today in this video, so be sure to drop a like and make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Firstly, GTA 6's main story is now reportedly 35 to 40 hours long, making it the longest GTA game and the second longest Rockstar title, because Red Dead Redemption, we all know too, is 50 hours of game time and and GTA 6 is now reportedly a total of 40 hours, which is insane because this is definitely way longer than GTA 5. Personally, the fact that GTA 5 is 31 and a half hours total, it's a little surprising because I feel like GTA 6 should almost be 50 to 60 hours long. But regardless, the story is not all we're talking about in this video because we have different things related to multiplayer and all the new things related to the characters. Super interesting. As you guys know, the Joker has been the main conversation after the fact of the trailer one. You guys definitely want to watch this video because it seems as if he's still reportedly wanting tons of money regards to his appearance being inside of the trailer one. GTA, GTA, we got to talk. GTA, we got to talk. Y'all playing with my intelligence. It been mad days. This is a final warning. I just came back from Miami. Just came back from California. Talked to both my Jewish lawyers. We send you a letter. We are waiting for a response. If we don't get a response, by after my birthday, which is January 11, we're going to take legal actions. I want $5 million now, $5 million. I'm getting harassed everywhere I go, the airport, the streets. You that GTA joker, you that GTA joker. What's good, GTA? Go talk to Take Two, your daddy. Rockstar GTA, go talk to take to your daddy. And so down in the comments, does he deserve this? Let me know because also this person is now claiming he wants a part of the action. So check this video out and let me know your overall thoughts regards to this because we still have tons to talk about related to the actual trailer too. Rockstar, GTA, whoever. Come on, man. Look at it. Look at the mouth. Yeah, they come out of chains. I only got one of my chains now. Look at the shades. Look at the hell, man. Come on, can I get paid? That's me right now. Come on, twinning. It's twin now. They don't clone top wrong, man. Why y'all want me to get paid? Come on, GTA, man. Y'all know this me, man. Y'all know a real Floridian that's known, man. Come on, y'all know this Florida boy. Come on, let me get paid. You hear me? I don't want to get no lawyer. I ain't no police ass nigga. I don't want no lawyer. I just want to check. So pay me. Let me turn to the side. Come on, man. Look at that boy. Y'all know that me. And what's super crazy is Ned Luke being the main protagonist in GTA 5 while he was playing Grand Theft Auto 5, someone has now swatted him during his live stream, which is definitely a little bit uncalled for. And I don't think people should be doing this in any sort of way. It's kind of crazy that people still do this to this day. It's kind of wrong, but I guess people just have to do what they got to do to get a little of attention. But it's kind of wrong to see that this has happened to such a great person. What's going on? Let's see. Hello. All right, let me look and see. All right, goodbye. <laughs> hey, guys. Oh, I'm getting swatted. Isn't that great? Uh, hey, so let me go live. All right, I'll be right back, guys. All right. Well, that was fun. Ah, nice try. Didn't work. <laughs> Didn't work. Just another day in the neighborhood, just like Mr. Rogers. Now for GTA 6, it seems as if we're going to be getting ourselves a brand new runway and as well as with gameplay relating to a brand new plane. And you guys can even see that this location is somewhat in Las Vegas. So it almost seems as if we're going to have a Las Vegas POI location. Now we all know it's mainly going to take place in Miami, Florida, but also we can assume that we're going to be able to travel around to places like LA, California, and then also being able to go to like Las Vegas, Nevada, and then obviously going to Georgia. That's going to be pretty cool 
cool. Let me know your guys' thoughts relating to that. Alongside that, the PS5 Pro and as well as with the new Xbox is supposedly going to be coming out late 2024, which this is perfect time because it seems as if that in September of 2025, that is when the official release date is going to be coming out here for GTA 6. So for GTA's trailer 2, you guys can see that Aiden Ross has also stated that he is going to be inside of the actual game and in the next trailer, and which you guys can see by this clip. Yeah, I will be in GTA 6. I um I can't speak on a lot of like when, but you'll see me in one of the following trailers, probably beginning to mid next year. Um, and I saw people saying you shouldn't be in it. You shouldn't be in it. I mean, it's SSB World, and that's the almost probably like one of the most mainstream servers of all time. And I, and the city, the game is based in Miami. You'll see. I don't play a big role in GTA 6, but I play a role where it's like, oh shit. You'll see. Which fits perfectly considering the fact that we are obviously getting like a new social media integrated inside of the actual game. That definitely is pretty interesting. And also just happening a couple hours ago, the new actor being actually Lucia has not followed Mario being one of the characters from GTA 4. So they followed each other again now, which is kind of interesting because a lot of people have speculated that this is the actual girl that plays the Lucia character here inside of GTA 6. And then also obviously Obviously, Mario being a GTA 4 character definitely makes a lot of sense as to why they maybe have followed each other just to talk about what's coming here inside of GTA. And that's kind of interesting as well. So let me know your thoughts regards to that. So overall, man, there's a lot of cool things happening here inside of the game. And also GTA 5 source code that took Rockstar years to write has reportedly sold for $2,000 and leaked by a modder. So this looks like a big lawsuits in the works regards to the modder who's also kind of integrated some things regards to GTA 6 and gameplay that was leaked a bit early like a year ago you guys may have remembered so a lot of cool things regards to the trailer too a lot of new release dates and if i had to guess the next release date it's most likely now going to be sometime in march would be my assumption so keep sure you guys are on the gta central channel i'll catch you guys in the next video drop a like subscribe peace out